Greetings. Today we will address the out-of-memory error in ASP.NET applications. The error occurs while publishing the application to the web server. The errors list in the output window error message and diagnostic log file show no significant details, just a system out-of-memory exception. An out-of-memory exception signifies a critical situation where an application attempts to allocate more memory than the system can provide. These are some potential causes of the error. Remember to clean and rebuild solution after every fix. Clean and rebuild your solution. Close Visual Studio and delete files from the bin, VS, OBJ, and packages folders. Close Visual Studio and delete files from the temp folder. In Solution Explorer, right-click the project and select Unload Project. Then, right-click the unloaded project and choose Reload Project. This will recreate any missing or broken project dependencies. Run Visual Studio with admin privileges. Ensure the target framework is suitable for the target environment. While developing, you typically run an application in debug mode, which causes DLLs to compile in debug mode. You should set the debug attribute to false in the web config file. For deployment, build your app in release mode. By default, applications are compiled in 32 bits. To change that, expand any CPU and click Configuration Manager. Under Project Context, expand Platform and click Create New. Under New Platform, select 64. Keep other settings unchanged and press OK. Make sure the project and active solution platforms are set to 64-bit. The server must have sufficient storage for the deployed files and memory for processing. On the publish window, set the configuration to delete all existing files. You can also manually delete all existing files from the server. Analyze the publishing steps. Identify which publishing step is causing the memory overload. Also, enable timestamps. Examine the output window for warnings. Some warnings may be causing the error. Ensure unnecessary files are excluded from the published package to prevent memory issues. Open VS Options. Search for IIS. Ensure use the 64-bit version of IIS Express is selected. Restart IIS on the server.
While publishing in the output window, if you notice that your application is using the 32-bit version of compiler exe instead of 64-bit. Expand the project properties and open the published profile. Then, under the property group, add the ASP.NET compiler path. You can ignore any warning messages. Use the Performance Profiler tool to monitor projects for memory leaks. To do this, go to the Debug menu and click on Performance Profiler. Make sure the solution configuration is set to Release. Then, select the Memory Leaks option and click the Start button to begin the process. You can refer to the related documentation for a more detailed analysis. Upgrade your Visual Studio to the 64-bit version. Restart your computer to close background processes, clear temporary files and cache, and update system files. In addition, consider these options to avoid the out-of-memory exception in ASP.NET applications.